basic kick defense here. A lot of my students, when they start sparring, they see a kick coming, they know it's a kick, they know what their, their opponent's trying to do, but they don't know where it's going. So basic defense for that is a three-point check. In case you're throwing a right kick at my body, I can bring my leg up and my hand over. If you guys are going to my head, I just bring my hand up a little bit higher. If it stays towards my leg, I don't bring my hand down, I just let my leg do the work. My leg's strong enough by itself to check that kick. You never want to reach down too far. So that's your basic check for, for kicks. Even if he turns it into a push kick, I still have my hand over here and I can still use that to scoop it away or at least get something in between us so I'm not getting hit. If I just keep my arm over here, he can turn that into a push kick and go right down the middle. For a beginner, you see a kick coming, you're not sure what's gonna, where it's gonna go, just bring the leg up, hand over, that will cover most of your bases. At least when you're beginning. As you get more experience and you're dealing with more experienced people, you're gonna have to switch it up a little bit. So, some of the drills that we like to do is just to break it down to simple things. We're gonna go again with a kick. We're gonna go one block, one evasion, one catch. So Casey's going right through the body, and I'm gonna block it. Second time, I'm gonna get out of the way. Third time, I'm gonna catch it. Okay, now you can do different blocks. If it's a high kick, I can do a two-arm block. I can also evade it from here. I can also catch it from here, but it's gonna be a little bit different. From here, you can push the leg away, or you can try to do something a little bit fancier. But again, it's block, evade, and catch. These are three good groups to think about when you're defending, but you can also combine these together. So if Casey's throwing a left kick to my body, I could just defend it. I could, again, please, I could just catch it. But I can also block and catch it. So he's throwing that kick and I block and catch. And I have him here for a sweep, or I can throw it back the other way for a punch. I don't have to limit myself to just those three, I can combine them. Same with the evading, he throws that left kick, I can move him out of the way. But I still want to keep his hand up in case my, my, my judging of my distance is off. And I can still use that blocking motion, even if I'm not blocking it, I can use that to maybe put his leg down in front of me so I can chop his leg. So it's a combination of a block and evasion. Start off with the basics, block, evade, catch. But as you get more experience, you know how you can put these things together to fit your style. Okay, so one more time, block, evade, catch. As you get more experience, you can start coming back with like a level two counter strike. So as Casey throws a kick at me, I can block and come back with a kick of my own. I can evade, come back and punch on my own. And I can catch and come back with a counter attack on my own. So that's for a little bit more advanced folks. All right, so that's your very simple drill, work on your kick defense. So I'm just editing this video and I realized I didn't say thanks for watching. So thank you for watching. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up, hit that like button. I shot a whole bunch of these, so there's gonna be at least one coming out every week, so make sure you hit subscribe. And if there's anything you'd like to see or you have any questions or you want me to do a, a video on something specific, write it down in the comments below. I'll make a video just for that. All right, thanks for watching.